Well, Felix, a big win for the guys last night, and it wasn't easy. Lots of twists and turns. How did you see the game? It was absolutely a big win for us. It was a nice game to be a part with. A part of. Uh, we had good times and bad times, but we stay composed. And uh, this is how the games are going to go on from now on. This is playoff hockey, and it can go uh, it can go all kinds of way in playoffs. And you just gotta keep with it, stay with it, and uh, keep to stick to the game plan and get good results. One of those strange moments in the game had to be when that shoot-in went off the glass and ended up in the back of your net. No fault of anybody in Moose Colors, just one of those rare bounces. How do you react as a bench to make sure you don't get distracted? Well, things like that happen. Sometimes you'll get those bounces. Sometimes they're going to go uh, the other way. But you got to keep going with the plan, uh, as I just said, because you don't control those bounces. And this is uh, funny enough, but in playoffs, there's kind of goals that you, you get against you or for you. So you got to go with the bounces and go from there. Interesting uh, in that period where you were able to follow it up, you get a good penalty kill, you get a power play that works out, you have a lead going to the third period. What was the mindset uh, coming out of that second period with so many moves one way or the other that took place? Oh, uh, we, uh, we stick with our plan, I'd say. Like, uh, we can't think about the score or uh, the way the game's going, the way the referees are refereeing the game. I think uh, we control what we control out there, and uh, when we do that, we've been doing that a lot lately, way better than before, and uh, we've had good results, so we, uh, we're going to keep doing so. Tie game and a critical game uh, well into the third period. Your line's on the ice. Alexi Dau and Jansen Harkins with you. You find a, a little quiet spot in front of the net. Were you surprised when the puck found itself, uh, found its way to you? I was hoping for it to find its way to me. And uh, Harks has a good vision and he saw me there. It was a really nice play. So I'm grateful for that. And you reacted well. You got two chances at it and, uh, and were able to lift a lot of times. The guy will just jam it into the pads. Did you, you surprise yourself with the touch? No surprise there. It's uh, the goal scorer uh, DNA in me that uh, took over there. Well, in all seriousness, you've got three goals in the last seven games. Is there something different? Are you feeling more confident around the net? You know what? I'm just uh, staying in the moment right now more than, uh, than before, and I'm very confident with the puck right now, and the, the bounces seem to be uh, going my way, and hopefully it uh, keeps going like that. I want to ask you about home ice. I've asked a number of players why things are going so well, and the answer I usually get is, I have no idea. Have you got any idea why things are working so well downtown? We're playing well, so we're getting wins. That's why. You don't talk about it? Just uh, You don't want to mess with it? I mean, we can talk about it, but uh, as long as we're playing like that at home or on the road, I think we'll get the results we're looking for, so we've got to keep doing that. Well, you talk about sticking to the plan. That's really the mindset, isn't it? It doesn't matter where you're playing. Yeah, absolutely. So as far as things go against that Texas team, uh, they've got a lot of weapons. They're a team that, that is a little tricky, aren't they? You have to watch for a lot of things about them. Yeah, they have a lot of skills and they have a lot of uh, veteran players that know how to, to play the game. They've been there before. They've been in that situation before where uh, it's tight to get into the playoffs. So I don't think these guys are uh, really nervous about that. They were going to play their game. And so we, so we have the same in our locker room, obviously. We have guys that have been around uh, this league and have been around critical situations. So. I think we have played the game the same way as we played the the other game, and did a couple of adjust. We will do a couple of adjustments there and there, but uh, overall it was a pretty good game. And if we do the same, uh, we get ourselves a chance to win this one too. And I'm sure that includes uh, the special teams, where their power play is so strong, second best in the league coming into the series, and uh, we were able to keep them quiet for a night. Yeah, they have a lot of weapons in that power play, so we're gonna have to be uh, to be sharp, and uh, everybody have to do their job there, and. Uh, if we do so, we, we put the chances on our side. Last question for you, you guy who looks at the standings every morning, or how do you approach that sort of thing? I don't. I don't look at the standings at all. Uh, we have our plan right now. We have our plan to get into the playoffs, and uh, as long as we stick to it, uh, we'll get in, and there's no point uh, really looking at it.